libre na roller coaster, walang kailangan bayadan. Manood ka lang dito sa wow. MPLI 2023 Playoffs Day Number Two. See you soon versus RSG Philippines Match Number One. Best of three, best of three ngayon sa laglaga knockout stage. First 37 seconds, unang nakaspot dito kung saan papunta ang friend mo laiba ko di si Light. So Vision Gaming muna ngayon ng RSG. So, konting ano muna, konting uh, follow the crumbs mo sa ginag. Saan pa na ngayon uh, ang uh, mostly ang jungle ng SYS? Yeah, yung actually, the jungle pathing is very clean so far for both teams. Itong, itong hindi ko, hindi ako hindi maalis sa isip ko eh. Bakit, Bakit? nag-ruby itong si Light? This is very interesting. Kasi, it's not something you see every day. Kasi, first pick nga siya, di ba? This is Yeah. I don't even see this on the normal games. I don't see this on some screens. Oh, so, right. Kaya galing to, no? May, uh, may pinagugutan si Light either. Okay, let's, let's think about it like a mechanical, like in-game. Kung may ruby, possibly, kung, magka, kung magkamali or magka miscal, magkaroon na miscalculation dito si Boxy with the Kaj or pwede niyang mahiling the lore from the backline. Kasi mostly, iiwan sa backline yung dalaway to aid with Kusei. So, either... Paunahan ng hila, paunahan ng setup. Kasi kung once ma-miss out nila yun, that's the time where um, where the Lily could actually actually aid for a burst through. Pero for SYS to look at their kind of setups, may hila, may burst, pero it, it will take some time. Ito, you know, napaka-exciting yan. Oh, that is for sure, it will take time. Pero right now, ang gusto nila, action, Jackson! Felix. Doon sa taas, Felix. Felix! Hindi na siya na-fix. Ayan na, that's with the flicker out. And for sure, ito na yung ina-expect na resulta ng RG Philippines with the pick-offs. With the, of course, Nats on a very uh, scary hero here. Um, ilang ilang torneo na ang nakita natin na napakalupit ni Nats dyan sa Arlot na yan. And uh, minaximize nila yun right here on the turtle area. Magkakaroon na din ng Divine Judgment si Boxy. So, it's gonna have to be may very, very rin, close. Nats pumasok sa loob. Sacrifice yung malupit. Sacrifice tunay. At yan na yung advantage na makuha mo, of course, with the Nether Realm. Although babagsak pa rin siya with the Appraiser's Rat. MP ang magsisecure sa unang turtle ng laro. And SYS showing force early on. 2-2 two to two on points. But that was a, a, a quick way to have that retribution on point. MP the King against Demon Kite. Una siyang natumba doon. It, it was the initiation. Naghihintay din si Boxy. Naspata mo na kanina. Konti na lang may Divine Judgment na lang. Actually, naka, ano, nakakailang talaga mag ganun doon. Pumuesto doon sa ganun. Especially knowing na magkakaroon ng Divine Judgment yung kalaban mong kaja tapos puno pa yung buhay. Yeah. Hindi ka talaga makapag... It's gonna be so hard to time that. And so far, ginamit na yung Appraiser's Rat para lang ma-take down itong si Felix. Which kita natin ngayon, 0-2. Two, at the very least, merong atake. May punto na pwedeng atakehin pa rin dito. Ang RSG Philippines, which is yun nga, yung XP lane. RSG, oh, oh, Aqua and Light. So, sinusubukan kumuha ng vision, pero nandito na yung response ng RSG Philippines. Eman, mukhang gusto kang kumuha ng free hit sa likod. Ran, nag-back away na rin. So, see you soon. Dahan-dahan kumukuha ng vision, pero just by look at the emblems here, meron tayong malulupit ng mga mix and match with our in-game stuff. So, meron yeah. din tayong uh, Quantum Charge. We have Brave Smite as well. So, mostly, ano, ang daming Brave Smite. So, ito yung parang way of like sustaining RSG's threat. So, ano ba yung condition nila ngayon pag mid-game na dumidiretso? Nag, uh, kung baga nag-snowball ang RSG Philippines. Yeah, ang pinakondition dito is Eman talaga. I mean, patagalin mo lang yung laro and get Eman to a point na kaya niya mang two hits, mang one hit, yan. Yun na yun. Pwedeng pwede na yun. Pero right now, obviously, it is going to be a bit of an uphill battle, especially since hindi pa natin nakita na nag-activate itong sila Nats with the, yung mga, fi mga Flicker Final Slash. Wala pang ganun eh. Hindi pa siya available. And that's also one of the downsides of picking a Ruby. Eh, kailangan talaga sobrang lakas nung burst sa likod para sulit yung Don't Run Wolf King, yung combo nila. Yung CC, ano, pinag-uusapan natin yun yung mga combo ng dalawang room. Uh, si Light and si Boxy. Meanwhile lang, uh, focus ngayon ng uh, team See You Soon ni Kusay at ni Boxy ay ang sa baba. So, slowly delaying. Mas ahead by half of an XP si Kusay on this Irithel. So, so far, nag-rotate ng mas maaga ngayon ng See You Soon. Yep. At mas nagkakaroon ng focus oh. sa objective. Nako po, napa-flicker ng malala si Kuya Light which means hindi nako, inaasahan nako, nako. at nagkaroon ng hulihan. Aqua going down bago siya makapag di, makapag black shoes. At yun na nga. At dahil doon, napaka-basic na galawan ginawa doon ng See You Soon. 
Ito naman ang makuha ng dalawang ng pangalawang turtle nitong laro to. Ito ang early game advantage ng team Cambodia. Kung say on the level 7 with the 8 as well with Boxy on the gold lane, mas nagkaroon sila ng opportunity to rotate faster for the objective. Mas na pressure kayo ng RSG to respond and contest with that objective. So kung titignan natin items back on the XP, they have a Steel Lake, uh, Steel Lake Plates present for, uh, for Nats as well. Molten Essence for Frederick. So we're, we're looking at standard uh, builds here and as well as for the Mage. So meron tayong enchanted Talisman, so mostly still building up. Yeah, the lead is not too far gone for uh, see you soon, pero mostly kinuha nila yung momentum nila early game. Na bulilya so yung plano kasi talaga dun eh, na pop leaker na maaga si Kuya Light nang walang ano eh, nang trying to get information. Mm -hmm. Ang hirap talaga nun, and because of that. Ayan, ang ganda naman ginawa Ayan. dito ng uh, See You Soon. Ayan, si Eman na pag-ligger yung palayo. Mahila. Kasi hilain na naman. Ayan na, si Kuya EB. And of course, with the Decimate, napakadaling target ng Bruno na yun, especially with low health. May ganti namang bagay. Bagya, anong gandang salo! Uy! Mula dito, Kaira! With the Netherrealm. Lalaban pa rin, tutuloy-tuloy. Masakit din naman ang Irritel nitong si Kase. And just like that, it's a two for none. Medyo, Para dito, see you soon. Medyo na corner doon si uh, Eman. Flickered out, but yung hila din mismo na ginawa ni Boxy. Talagang nabox siya mismo dun sa second, <laughs> the second tier turret. To the point na RSG is still looking for a way to uh, cope up with the gold, even just by the gold dito 2.7k. So dahan-dahan nilang sana gusto bawin, pero they're all... See, so it's, it's really forcing RSG Philippines to respond on team fights. Yeah, and halata mo na, na nauhuli sila nung si Yusu na wala sa pwesto. Kasi bigla silang nababa-flicker palayo eh. Yeah. Instead of offensive the flicker, yung paharap, Laging pa safety. Ayan na nga ba? Ayan na, tuloy-tuloy na. Ang gandang hila na naman mula dito kay Boxy on the Kaja. Divine Judgment once more being used onto Light. And kita mo, ito yung disadvantage din ng pagiging Ruby. Talagang madali kang lapitan, madali kang dikitan ng kalaban. At ngayon, Kaja pa ang iyong kalaban. Yeah. Third, third of the game. Magandang pwesto ka ng See You Soon. And RC Philippines not seeing to contest this at all. So yes, going back to your point, Rockart, yung, yung situation ngayon ni Light, gusto niya kumuha ng vision, pero ngayon, just by the XP difference, na kahit konti, ilang beses siya pwedeng mahuli dito, and yun yung dapat niya kasi iwasan. Kasi kung titignan natin, 0-0-6 na naging assist kayo ni Boxy, at kada commit ng RG to take that vision, for the team, doon sila mismo nagkakulong. So, maybe fr from this point, kailangan din nalang yung team kung kailan sila mag pwede magiging malakas. Ayun nga eh, kailangan maging malakas muna kayo bago kayo makagalaw. Ang problema dito sa RSG, so far, hindi pwedeng basta-basta mag-engage sila light at saka sila... Oh, hila, may hila. Ayan na nga ba si sabi ko, oh, si Demon kahit medyo pinil pinabilis. Grabe, tunaw siya sa harap ng See You Soon. Hindi niya kayong tumagal that long. And now, it's the dive going straight into the tower. Naglalaro na sa ilalim, medyo risky na maglaro ang CU soon dito, which is mas confident na sila. May konting punish ba na magaganap? Looks like wala muna. It was always the push. Team CU soon, napilang apat na member ng RSG, four ultimates completely depleted. At nung nahuli doon mismo si Demon, kahit nagkulang sila doon, mismo ng vision from that river. At ganun kabilis na gusto kontrolin ng si Yuzon mismo, pati yung kanilang waves. Doon pa lang, doon pa lang nagkulang sila. It's the vision, and even the way of holding that damage, kailangan din nila ng defense items. So, mamaya may kita natin kung ano nga ba yung pwede pa na blah. Pero at this point, we could, we could still really consider na they should not commit on those kinds of uh, possible pick-offs. Inuunahan kasi sila lagi ng si Yuzon. Kita mo yan, nag-flicker in si Baxi. Buti na lang, wala pa masyadong. Distansyang makover si At walang wala na huli na nila Pero si Light na wala Parang na nakita ko yata yung paa Lumabas yata yung paa sa damo Pero hindi nila napansin <laughs> Hindi napansin Hindi na safe, Okay safe. na That's good that, that, For see you soon Okay na okay din yun Kasi nakibrang Tori naman sila Yeah And, and kung Tori ang pag-uusapan Progress of the two junglers Ahead by uh, Three levels Si MP 3-0 and 2 Against a Demon Kite It's the first lord of the game In the lead of Almost 6,000. So, ito yung kailangan gusto bantayan ng RSG. Wala, box out na box out. Hindi naman yung pwesto ha. Delikado ako. May konting silip lang dito. Kasi lagi magkasama si Ratcha kasi Boxy. Insta-kill, insta-suppress. At ang lahat na nagagawa ng RSG is either pa-follow up lang sila doon. So, right now, dapat di sila mag-commit for this. I think this, ano, ito yung ika nga ng mga problem. Bigay, bigay, bigay na yan, bigay na yan. Gay na lang yan. Yun yung mga call, eh, no? Sa ngayon. And, uh, yeah, they just need time, eh. Matagal-tagal pang oras. Even Aqua right now, dun sa kanyang, ano, Lilia, 
Ito yung cons din ng Lilia. Matagal talaga mag-ramp up yan, mamin. Conceal, oh. May na-conceal si Boxy na-conceal. Conceal the wheel! Don't let them know! Pero wala muna. Nahuli na ng steam. See you soon. Basag muna ng Torre. Konting depends ang RSG Philippines. Still Lord pushing down bottom. De depends ang ngayon ng Pilipinas. Kailangan maka makapaghanap ng paraan si Light to catch either one or two kasi they can't fully commit for a full team fight. Eh, to be fair, yun talaga. Wala, wala, nang, wala nang choice. OSX, commit, less, ano. Uh, hindi ka pwedeng mag-commit. Hindi, hindi talaga. Yeah. Ayoko humu... Ay, oh, oh, goto, goto. Hindi, hindi, mahirap hindi kasi... Oy, ano, ang, ay, hindi ka ako commit na yun. Yeah, hindi, mahirap, mahirap. So, so, if they ever... Hindi, <laughs> 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 pero eh... Oh, mahirap talaga. Mahirap talaga mag-commit na yun. Kasi ngayon, si Eman, ang inaantay natin, si Aqua. Pag tumagal yung game, dun sila lalamang eh. Yung RSG. Late game din eh. Super late game talaga eh. Well, ang tanong dito, kaya ba nilang paabutin sa late game? With, with the lead of CU soon has, they're not stopping. Nasa base na nga sila. Gusto nilang bumasag ng Torres sa babae. Eh. Late game lang. Matuturo, hinawa Ay, yung pasinats. Ay, nako si Kuya Nats. Nadali dun sa Gedli. Gedli magic. Apat ng members sa ba at isa sa taas. That means confident na ang CU soon here to split up the map, get at least one inhibitor turret na manidepensahan pa naman yata. Even MP na king, di ba sobrang risky na nung galaw niyo doon. Hindi pa rin siya... Hindi pa rin siya ginaw. Tatlong miyembro ng RSG, dikit sa Torre, tas MP lang nandun. Hindi sila nag-go means na yun talaga ang plano nila. Zero commit, don't go for the push. Let si Yusun come hanggang umabot sa punto na napaka-hapti na ni Eman. Yeah, so sinubukan nga kunin ni Felix si Eman. Pero ang nag naging maganda rin distansya dito ng RSG because they know from that conceal, either of them could actually be picked off or pulled out. So Lord Advantage with a gold earned. Na, nasa see you soon ang possibility in, in with the tower HP isa pa lang ano kuha sa team see you soon so this, this answer is like what's the damage ano yung depends ngayon ng RSG even for the player's gold kusin na ang una kasama si Epi the King oh. Eman and Demon Kite for RSG ngayon ang, sum ang gustong sumunod mahirap to, Tira, may rotation ito lahat sila lahat sila they're, they're looking for a way to shut down RSG Philippines. They're going to get the objective. They're going to get the objective that can be salvaged from this kind of a struggle against you soon. Until there's a base, there's a trust. And just like I mentioned earlier, you're going to be slow while you're going to be slow. This engagement of RSG. So make sure that as long as possible, the inhibitor turrets are going to die so that you don't have a scary one side lane push. And then make sure na meron din kayong... Wala, time lang talaga. Time. Ginagawa so, din ng RSG. Huh? Yeah, total, ginagawa din naman ng RSG. As you've mentioned, maganda din yung mga... May, mga, may freeze din nangyayari from top to bottom. So, ang ginagawa lang nila ngayon, they're waiting for the right moment. They're waiting for the time for Eman to actually be, uh, be online and activated. So, they're letting go of all of these objectives. Ang ginagawa, nila, ginagawa lang nila is either clear, push, hindi mo na magkocommit. Nakasalali ngayon ang kanilang setup either... Uh, from Light or from Nats, knowing that these two, they, they play so well, especially on those kinds of moments na akala mo, tapos na. Akala mo, hindi na pwedeng maagapan. Ang kailangan nila isang magandang entry sa likod. Isang magandang entry sa backline ng Siusun, at dun pwedeng mabaway. As you said, late game, ang pwedeng choice, ang pwedeng chance ng RSG Philippines. Late game lang, man. Late game lang, we're yeah. never gonna stop. Yeah. Hinga lang, hinga lang. Hinga lang. And hinga. actually, yung ginagawa ng Siusun ngayon, na medyo hindi din sila masyadong aggressive, sila din ma pag, pag hindi sila nag-ingat, sila din malulugi dyan eh. Actually, ang hinihintay lang natin dito, isang malupit na final slash. Men, kailangan na mag-activate ng Nats Entertainment. Kailangan, gusto na namin ma-entertain. Gusto ko na makita yung five-man final slash. Tapos sabay, ano, hila. Ito si, ano, si Light. Or, pwede Kailang baliktad, pwede baliktad. Pwede si Light na mauna. Kailangan maging ganun talaga yung coordination. You need to have that final instinct na parang kailangan to go into for the team. But also, they're also being careful din na hindi magkamali. So, they're looking for a way for, for you soon to commit that mistake. Ano nga may pwede kailangan? Ay, 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 Ayun na nga, no? Yun yung senses. Yun yung Eman senses. Yun yung oh. RSG senses. Muntik na yun. Conceal, flicker, lahat na ginamit doon. So, minus one. Kaja is no more. Kaja cannot be actually used here in the fight. Pero, that doesn't mean na walang push na mangyayari. See you soon. We'll still get 
all the inhibitor turrets dito sa game na to. Okay, the base is the only thing left for RSG Philippines. I think that's one way to deplete a resource out of boxing, no? Kapit lang! Yung mga ganun, yung mga ganun klaseng mga moment na okay. Kung pwede naman drain out ang isang, isang malupit na setup from CU soon, ito yung pwedeng uh, opening ni Light or Nats. So, konting abang, pero hindi ang busy for the clear and the push. Pero sa totoo lang, kailangan pa rin... <laughs> Kung kailangan natin ng mga limang moments na ganun from CU soon bago talagang mag-quits yung gold sa game. Pero at this point, ang gusto lang naman ng RCPH, umabot tayo sa punto na hindi na importante yung gold. Which yeah. is mangyayari naman yun once nag-item lock din lahat ng members ng RCPH, maybe around five minutes. Ayan, sige tama yan, mag-TV pa kayo! Mag-TV pa kayo hanggang mamaya! Pahuti yun na 20 minutes! Oh. <laughs> Tama yan! Tagal na. Tituloy nyo yan! Yan! yan. Sige! Tipi lang! Okay, by the way, maganda yung mga recall natin ngayon ha, sa MLBB. So, Wag kunin, kayong pumitas. Kunin nyo na hanggang nandyan pa. So, ngayon, kung titignan natin, sabi mga items lang kailangan ng RSG Philippines. We have the Hask Claws and Warrior Boots. Malefic Roar. So, Bruno has physical penetration and added physical penetration. So, kailangan nalang magandang pwesto ni Eman. Magandang setup from Light. Isang on kay Demon Cat. Madami silang pwedeng ma-work on this. Like, it could be a CC domino effect. So, or si Filipe, isang pwede lang mapagana. So, sabi mo, the only thing that could happen is for Gombode is to commit a mistake. Yun lang talaga. Isang one, isang one, one mistake lang talaga. Isang one one mistake. mistake. At lahat ito pwede mabaliktad ng Pilipinas. Apa. So, that's also the reason why you pick up yung mga hero tool ng, ng Ruby. Mm -hmm. Diba? Mm -hmm. ng, ng isang Arlot. Gusto mo yung malupit na set eh. Which is, hindi pa natin nakita, di ba? So far, 16 minutes dumaan, may nakita pa tayong malapit set. Di ba? Wala pa naman siya. Eh. Ang problem, I guess that's the reasoning why naisip ko din, okay din yung Valentina, mas may konting... May konting na ako, may, may konting... konting aggressiveness may kon aggressive. na... May gulat factor eh. Oh, Wala kasing gulat factor yung liga eh. Gulat factor nga ba? Kaya hindi ko siya inexpect eh. Ay, nako po! Nautog yata ka rin mo sa ako! Ay, ayun na nga. Ayun na, ipit na, ipit. Ayun na. Ayan na, buha ba na Appraisers Rat? May DPS kaya si Eman. It's all up to the Eman. It's all up to the Kiling of Buildings of Light and Eman. And Nats, rather. Kaya ba depensahan? Na depense. Can they do it? Ayan na. Hanggang sa dulo. Si MB, the king pa rin. MB pa rin ang maunguna dito. And Light, they're trying really hard to defend. Pero looks like it's a 1-0. Para sa see you soon.